Listen to this story from a cheating man. Sadly, I cheated on my girlfriend while she was pregnant, and I did it with my best friend twice. Now, here comes the part where he tries to make it sound not so bad. We didn't have intercourse, just oral. Now, let's try to justify it. I did it because I was feeling overwhelmed by the pregnancy and wanted some freedom. I feel horrible for even knowing that I thought like this. I begged, cried, stupidly proposed to her, and pleaded for her forgiveness. But she kicked me out, blocked me, and during that time I was pretty much homeless. Cheating on her was the worst mistake of my life. I missed her so much and realized that everything I ever complained about was stupid. She did everything for me and loved me like no one else, and she was an amazing mother. But after a few weeks, she decided to give me another chance before our son was born. But it was a roller coaster. One moment she would be fine, and the next she would just stare at me like she hated me. She even kicked me out again two weeks before her son was born because she said I was triggering her. But I think it was due to her needing more help during her third trimester. No! It's because of you. That's what's frustrating. Men don't understand what a big deal this is. I've stopped going to therapy because I have so much going on, trying to provide for my family and help with our son. She still cries. She still gets angry, and I cringe every time she watches a TV show that brings up affairs because it triggers her again. The guilt I feel for almost losing my family is overwhelming. I love them more than anything and want to marry her one day. She even mentioned wanting an open relationship to see what else is out there since I did the same thing. I'm not okay with this, and I know that's not her at all. She's thought the same thing about you. She could say that same sentence. She could say, I know that's not him at all. She could have said that at one time. Not anymore. I've given her full access to my phone, cut out my old friend, and I reassure her all the time. I try to treat her like the queen she is. I can't take back, take back the past, but I want to be a better man for her. Is there any hope? I had a feeling that if you didn't have a child together, you would be gone. So I don't know if there's hope. Matter of fact, it sounds like you still are struggling with some issues yourself. You try to justify it. You try to... Uh, make it sound like it wasn't as bad. Nobody cares about that. It doesn't matter. If, if On a path of true forgiveness, you just say from the very beginning, I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. I was wrong. You don't give any sort of justification. You don't give any reason why you did it. You don't sit there and try to say, this is why it happened. Those things don't matter. And if you give justification to her like you tried to convince the internet, No wonder she's triggered. And you've got a lot of growing up to do.